I bought you 12 roses for Valentine's Day. 11 are fake, one is real. No, wait. <laughs> I bought you 12 roses for Valentine's Day. 11 are real, one is fake. I will love you till the last petal fades away. Easy way to get out of that, and I was just cut the petals off and be like, done! That's mean. Don't do that. Hello everyone, welcome to Dadass. I'm Kelsey PJK, and today we'll be talking about love. Getting pretty serious. Hashtag love. Hashtag romance. Hashtag all this and more in the next several minutes. Woocha! So, I don't know if you know this about me, but I actually am single. Yeah! And to be honest, single people aren't really that fond of Valentine's Day. That's not actually true for me. I'm really excited about Valentine's Day. And it's not just because I have really awesome Valentine's Day plans. It's partially that, but it's also just because I'm already in love. <laughs> Rewind, stop the tape. You're in love and you're single? How could that possibly be? Well, of course I am. I mean, I bet a lot of you are. I'm in love with video games. I'm in love with life and I'm in love with who I am as a person right now and whom I'm, I'm becoming, which is awesome because that doesn't always happen and hasn't really been the case for a lot of my life. Hashtag grown up. I'm in love with my friends and I'm in love with Doctor Who. My sonic screwdriver says, you're hot! I'm in love with art and the satisfaction of finishing a puzzle. I'm in love with reading a beautifully composed sentence in a beautifully composed book that just makes my heart gasp for air. I'm in love with William Shakespeare. Comic books, Deadpool, Neil Gaiman. I'm also in love with staying up too late and writing a long list of things that I'm in love with. <laughs> Love is complex and it's incredible and it is my firm belief that I don't have to just celebrate one single side of love when it is something that is completely multidimensional. The one thing that is predictable about life is its unpredictability. Yes, that is a quote from Ratatouille, but it's also just so incredibly true. Love is wild and it's unpredictable and that's kind of one of the reasons why it's great. I mean, I could fall in love with tomorrow. I could fall in love with a person. I could fall in love with a dog, which is probably much more likely. And me and that dog will run away together into the sunset. My parents won't approve because let's face it, I can't afford a dog right now, but when we look into each other's eyes, we'll know it's real. What I'm actually trying to say in this video is that I believe that even if you're single on Valentine's Day, or even if you're not, don't let society's expectation of what Valentine's Day should be make you feel any less about yourself or your own romantic love situation. Just because there isn't a card for the type of person or thing or whatever that you're in love with doesn't mean that it's not great. But anyway, because Dadass is normally, you know, known for its hilarity and wonderfulness as opposed to its random speech things, whatever this week was, we include the following footage of Kelsey being Kelsey. I'm sorry I didn't get you a box of Valentine's for Valentine's Day, but if you want something sweet, I'm right here! Once you go Cupid, the rest are just stupid. That was me trying to wink. Do you believe in love at first sight, or should I tell Cupid to shoot you with one more arrow? <laughs> what? When I look at you, I see more stars than the cast list of that Valentine's Day movie. Oh! <laughs> if you need to pick up someone for Valentine's Day, use that one. That one was clever and great. I'm a nightmare dressed like a daydream. No, I think it should be opposite. Cause it's totally I'm a nightmare dressed like a daydream. Wouldn't that make sense? With my own voice, not like Taylor Swift. She does it perfect. I'm talking about me personally as a human being right now. In this moment of life. Isn't life beautiful? Ah, uh, hug. Hey you! Yeah you! You right there! You should be my Valentine. But you know how you can become my Valentine? By subscribing! Yes, it's we weren't expecting that, were you? No, probably not. No. If you're already subscribed, then you can be my Valentine, but liking below. 
<laughs> so click that thumbs up button below to let me know you love me. Because obviously you do or you wouldn't have been watching the video this far in. Subscriber of the week this week is my awesome, awesome cousin Samantha. She actually has her own blog that is called Cottontails, which is adorable because that's her family's last name. <laughs> so cute. Her really great blog is about being a first time mom and it's really cool. So go check that out if you want to actually learn about being a grown up. <laughs> Cause I just kind of pretend, but she's actually doing it. So check that out, link below. And uh, that's all I've got. Bye. I'm in love with an Ewok. He bowling, he growing, he bowling. He's protecting Han and Leia. I'm in love with an Ewok. Oh wow, 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 wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did I nail that or did I nail that? High five.